Today I'm going to show you how to make the classic bow, but instead of having a regular clip on the back, it's going to have a ponytail on the back. Very simple. The only difference is it's going to have the ponytail instead of the alligator clip. You will need your ruler, your lighter, scissors, hot glue gun, two pieces of one and a half inch grow grain ribbon that are each eight inches long, and one piece that's four inches long. Uh, you can use either three eighths inch ribbon this one I am using 5 8 inch ribbon. I like that a little better when it comes to the ponytails, but you can do it whichever way you want. And you will need your ponytail. Once you get your ribbon cut, you are going to heat seal your ends, which I have already done on these two, so I will do it on this one. And you're just lightly going over it with your lighter to prevent any fraying. Especially if you're going to be selling them, you don't want any fraying. And you're going to um, fold it in half, put a crease in it, in both of your eight inch one and a half, the eight inch long, one and a half inch grow grain ribbons. If you have a pattern on it, you're going to want the pattern on the outside. I'm going to, once you get your crease, I'm going to open it up and right just on the inside of your crease, you're going to make a line, a small line of glue and bring this up, bring the end up just to the crease and glue it down and you're going to do the same thing on this side just to the inside of the crease make your line of glue bring the end up to the center so it will look like like this you're going to do that with both sides, with both of the eight inches of your one and a half inch grow grain ribbon, just to the inside of your crease is the glue, bring the side up and do the same thing to the other side. You'll have two pieces that are the same. You're going to fold, once you have this like this, you're going to fold it length, you know, long ways towards the front. The back is where the, the glue was, where the seams are. You're going to fold it to the front right in half long ways and you're going to put a dot of glue in the middle and you just want the middle done not the whole thing because you're going to be folding these sides down once that's done you're going to again fold this side down Till it meets right in the middle and I find that it it's easier if you're making sure that the whole bow looks kind of pretty as you're going along it will t I have found that it turns out better that way <coughs> and you're going to do the same thing to the other side Again, I kind of just Crease it down. I'm sorry for my dog. I 
put a dot of glue. Pinch it closed. So you'll have one piece like this. You're going to do the same thing with the other one. Where your seam is, you're going to do it towards the front, fold it in half to where the, they meet. Put a small dot of glue in the middle. And again, you're not doing it up the whole side, just in the very middle. You're going to fold your side down. You don't have to fix the bow like I do. I have just found that it's easier for me to continuously fix it as I'm going along. Seems to turn out prettier for me. And you're going to do the same thing with the other side. Fold it up. And glue that side. Hold it, and now you've got both sides of your bow. Now, you're going to put the two sides, the two pieces together, like this. You can put your glue here, and then put them together. I have found, for me, that it's easier to put them together make the bow the way that I want it to look, like this. And then I will kind of put my thumb in the middle here, make a small opening, and put my glue gun down and then add a little bit of glue down there. Pinch it together. And hold it until it dries. I'm going to take, in this case it's 5 8 inch, but it can also be 3 8 inch, even a half inch. It, it's totally up to you. I'm going to get it in the back and add just a little bit of glue here. If there is a pattern, you're going to want the pattern on the outside. I'm going to add a little bit of glue here. Press and hold till it sets. And in, an, in the normal bows, right here is when you would be adding your alligator clip. But in this case, I'm adding the ponytail. So you just add a little bit of glue to the center of the back of the bow. And the part that where the pony is glued together, that's the part that I push down into the glue. And at the same time, bring your other end through so that it's still in the glue. It helps the ponytail stay up like that. Once that part is dry, then you just wrap and keep wrapping until you're done. And you will glue the end right here. I always wipe off any excess glue so you don't see it. have it. A classic bow with the ponytail holder. Thank you.